Did you know that the DV theme has not really been updated for a very, very long time? So you could be in a situation where you love DV, but the theme is very dated. There are other themes out there like the Astra theme, which I'll show you in this video, which you can combine with the DV theme to come up with an awesome web designing experience. Let me show you how you can do this. So here, let me show you where the DV theme is. So if you take a look at this website, I'm using the DV, full DV theme and the DV builder. So if you were to come over here, if you go to themes, you'll notice that we are actually running the DV theme. And here it is. So if you want to go in and customize what's in the DV theme, this is where it would come. You click on customize. And the only things that you'll find here are very, very basic. So here we have our general settings. So if you come over here, you can set up your site identity, layout settings. You can uh, set up your width and so on and your accent color. But as you can see, that's about it. This is where you can just add your accent color. And pretty much that's it. If you come back over here, there's also other things like the typography. You can set up your typography here. And again, you have very minimal colors. Now, let me show you what the Astra theme can do. So if I come over here now, we have the Astra theme. So I'm going to come over here to the dashboard of Astra. Now here, you're going to be greeted with a ton of features. Now look at this. We have our site identity. If I come over here to header builder, we can actually go in and build our own header using uh, the Astra theme. So these are the sort of things which, in my opinion, the DV theme should have done and as well as they're designing the Divi Builder itself. But of course, I mean, <laughs> I'm not sure uh, what's up with that. But anyway, look at this. We have a dedicated header builder here. So you can add your site logo here. And if you wanted to customize this, you can just click over here and you can go into your settings. You can adjust your size for... Guys, did you hear that? <laughs> that is thunder. It's really raining over here. Anyway, so this is where you'd go in and customize this. You can go into the design. There's also more features here. You can go, you can add your background color by coming over here. You can add a blur. You can add your padding. There's so much you can do. And the really cool thing here is you can also go in here and start customizing the mobile view and the... Um, tablet view. So you can come over here and set all your settings. Now there's a lot to customize here. Now if you look at this, we also have the page. So you can customize how you want your pages to look. So in this case, you have narrow, you have the default here, you have normal, you can also set it up as boxed. And over here, you can see we have the uh, sidebar style. There's a lot that you can change here in terms of the pages themselves. Let me just cancel this. And uh, let me just hit publish. Now, I want to show you even more features. So if I close out of here now and uh, we take a look at uh, the typography, you can set your default typography across the whole website. You can also set your colors. Now, the Astra theme has a dedicated color uh, customization uh, layout, which is fantastic. Now, remember, when I showed you the DV version, they only had one color. But here we have a lot of colors to play around with. So let's take a look here at the global colors. You can see here we have different styles. We have all these colors here that we can use. You can set your accent color, the links, the heading, the body, the borders. Pretty much you can do everything here. You know, it's very, very exciting. Now you can obviously come over here and add your header one, header two, three, four, five, six, set up all your colors. And this is going to look great. So let's take a look and see how you can actually use this as you're building your website. But before I do that, I want to show you something very interesting. So let's say you want to build a WooCommerce website. Out of the box, this theme, the Astra theme, also has a way of customizing your product page, your catalog, your single product, your cart, and everything. So let me just show you something here quickly. If I go to single product, look at the layout here. I can adjust this to have a product title. I can go into the design here, set my colors, my category color, my price color, pretty much every single little bit that you may want to go in and customize, you can customize it here. Now let's take a look at the end result. Now, how will this look? Now we're gonna come over here to our products and let me just show you what this looks like. Out of the box without any designing at all. So let's take a look at this product right here. I'm gonna click on view so we can see this in a new tab. Now I know this is a very basic layout but if you're doing this for a client or even for your own website, you can have this up and running just like that. So here we are. We have this. You can click on add to cart by coming over here. 
And now you can see here, we have added everything to the cart. If you wanna view the cart, you can click on view cart over here. And there we go, this is my cart. And if you wanna to proceed to check out, you can proceed to check out by clicking over here. Now, everything is pre-designed for you. This is the cool thing. So there we go. You have your addresses here, your zip code, and it was, it's also sticky. You know, it sticks here on the top and you can place your order. So as you can see, out of the box, this is really, really working. You don't have to spend so much time trying to customize how WooCommerce should work. Everything is done there for you. Now, let's take a look as well at uh, a few other things. We want to now take a look at a normal page. So I'm going to come over here to pages, click on all pages. Now, remember, I mentioned that this is the Astra theme, but you can also use Divi with it. So let's take a look at, uh, let's say, this page right here. I can actually go in and edit with Divi, but this is the Astra theme. So you may be wondering, so what the hell is happening here? So let me show you. If we come over here to Elegant Themes, you can either buy the Divi theme or you can uh, use the Divi Builder plugin. So right now, I'm using the plugin with the Astra theme. So I've done away with the DV theme itself because if you recall earlier on, I said it has very, very minimal features. Whereas the Astra theme has so much. You can customize your typography, you can customize your fonts, you can use WooCommerce, Learn Dash out of the box. So this is where the power comes in. So if you wanna set up uh, this setup, like I did, you now have to download the DV Builder plugin and install the Astra theme. So anyway, let's take a look here at uh, this page. So here I can go in and say, use existing content. And now I can use my, so I can come over here, add my columns, and I can now continue on to use uh, Divi as I would normally would if I was using the Divi theme. So as you can see, this is a very, very powerful way of designing your websites with the Astra theme and the Divi Builder plugin if you want the latest features from the well-developed uh, themes out there. In this example, I'm talking about the Astra theme. It's a very, very solid theme. And uh, I'm pretty sure it has the highest downloads out there. So it's very, very popular and it is well uh, maintained and it has a lot of great features. Anyway, I have the links to uh, all this in the video description below. So check it out. Uh, the link to the Astro theme is there and also the link to buy the Divi theme is also in the video description below. Let me know how you guys use Divi. Do you use Divi itself with the theme or do you use the theme builder like Astra with the Divi Builder plugin? Or do you even know that you could actually do this? Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you again in the next one. Take care.